That's not my problem, bro. But clearly, I, is it my problem? You, okay, let me ask. What's up, God? Is it my problem? This, let me ask you a question. No, no, no. Ask yourself. Is it my problem? Wait, wait, wait. You rally round. You will rally round. You will rally round. You will rally round, and you will also rally round. <laughs> It's your boys at the In My Opinion podcast. Yes, sir. We're back again. Mm -hmm. You already know what it is. I'm your boy, Melinda the Fourth, aka the Gyarum Sukadi, aka. Oh, what was that one? Oh. Um, Uganda, people's champion. Oh, the people's champion, <laughs> aka the Uganda Lion. Eh, I almost forgot. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yes. DTM, aka Designated Driver. It's your boy, Uzi, aka Uzoma. You already know. Come mm. on. And obviously, today we are joined by a very, very special guest. Yes. Um, I find her very annoying, but everybody else seems to love her. Yes, wow. we do. Uh, none other than the queen herself of yes. the edits. Yes. Leone Joyce. Hey, guys. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> welcome to the podcast. Thank you for having me. Been, you know, it's been a minute. I've been trying to get you on, but I see... No, you, you haven't thing. been trying yeah, to get yeah. me on. I think I've been trying to come on, but <laughs> anyway. Wow. wow. <laughs> I just got an error on the message. Wow. <laughs> wow. This is family matters. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, is there, we, is there are, we, are, we, are, we are exempt. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> there you go. That's about to, is there something you need to tell us? Oh, wait, wait, wait. We didn't know she was Are they not equally accountable? No, 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 no. It's a family situation with us. There you go. Yeah, Thank you. Thank We're you exempt. very much for that. Yeah. I don't think her mic's picking up this stuff. No, it is picking up. <laughs> <laughs> very, the signals are very strong. <laughs> That's to say. Anyway, let's be positive. Why do we have to look at the negative? The fact is, you're here now. Yes, you're here. You're looking very lovely. Thank you. The time is right. As we high say. Very high. Very knee high. <laughs> knee high. But it's okay. You look lovely. Thanks for coming on. Knee the high, which means high maintenance. How do you get that? that off the rip. Them, if you're off the rip. Off the rip. I, I like that. When it goes past this length, uh -huh. this high maintenance. Anything high means high maintenance. High maintenance. Really? I believe Watch that. Watch out for a female in that booth. I believe that because. <laughs> because. She does, she's a vegan, first of all. Oh. oh. Yeah. Already you know. Well, already you just know. to clarify, I'm actually pescatarian, but Marvin doesn't get out much, so he so doesn't let me Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, what say oh, you to that? <laughs> <laughs> Too much matoke. <laughs> what were you actually doing? <laughs> wow. like, so I eat fish. Yeah. I just don't eat meat, chicken. I like that. Yeah. why? Um, I don't really want to, you know, kill animals. Oh. You yeah. care about the animals. You're <laughs> killing fish. Are they not animals? I know. <laughs> I'm getting to the point where I'll, I don't eat fish every day. Like, I'm like... Okay, what's your favourite vegan meal? Vegan burger? I'm trying to catch her out. Pes <laughs> I'm trying to catch her out. Exactly. To, to be fair, a lot of, like, Ugandan food is vegan friendly. Oh. What's your favourite Ugandan food? <laughs> what's, what's that? Nyamachoma. <laughs> Nyamachoma. Nyamachoma. She can't eat that. Oh, she don't eat chicken. She can't eat, she can't eat fried fish. fish. <laughs> Definitely not ah. the beans. What's the beans, isn't it? Mm, what's the, the no, I'm, I'm not bad at Yeah, I'm not bad at yeah, Maybe Janjaro. Yeah, anyway, I'm, let's, I'm not too too much. <laughs> let's not too much about Uganda. These guys are very anti Ugandan. Oh, so I, I swear wanna, we I are. Wanna, I don't want to go down that path. That's what you're doing, Ashley. Ah, cool. Leonie J, some people don't know who you are. Yeah. Tell them about yourself. What's your background? Um, so I am a content creator. Mm -hmm. I make videos on Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, um, and spread joy. And a lot of people may not know, I started out wanting to be a music video director. So that explains my videos a bit more and people will get mm -hmm. why I make the videos I make. Oh, wow. Yeah. Did you not see the pun in there? Sorry. She said I spread joy. My name's Joyce. Did, you, did, did that go over your head? No, it went over my head. It never went over my head. You caught that, yeah? No, it went over my head. went over my head. But Sorry, no, that's dope, though. No, 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 no. Because I'm, I'm on your page, right? I, I can't remember. This was about last month. Mm. I was on Instagram. And then when I opened up Instagram, your page came up. Mm. And I was like, and I went straight. I'm sure this guy's going to test it. I copied the link and I put it in our group. Right? Like, look, we got to have a run in it. Mm. I don't okay. care how. I don't care what we got to do. But we need to have a run in it. Because... I was just scrolling through and it's just like what you said, whatever he hates about you, because they hate her anyway. He's like, he's just smiles, smiles, smiles. Just no, happy. but why is she always happy? What do you mean? Nah, I don't know why she always happy. happy. Bro, it hurts me that I'm struggling <laughs> in this life. Bro. Even today, I'm not struggling. No, you're not struggling. You know that was that you're not struggling. You're not, you're just not grateful. Thank you. Stress is a Thank choice. You. I go through a lot of things as well. I there you go. choose to be happy. Yeah, you're always you smiling. Because I'm kiki, choosing every day, to be kiki, happy. Kiki, yeah. every day, kiki. I would just appreciate if just for once, you can, kiki. I can relate to your struggle. <laughs> but I can't relate to your happiness. I know, I love it. I love the fact that... I want to relate to our struggle. No, no, no. Walking high heel boots. 
Go on, you try walking high heels. Wait, I, should, I should walk a mile in my shoes. Have... Okay, so oh, what's yeah. been your best Leonie Joyce edit so far? Obviously, we've seen her recent Baychella. Today. Is that your best one? There was um, one that she had a, sh- um, a post in Shade Room, didn't she? Yeah, that was, that that was, that was, that was the, crazy. That was, was it? I think that was Beyonce, Say My Name. Yeah. Ah, that's dope. You know, everyone I do is always my favourite at the time. So okay. I guess the top few would be the first one I ever did. And that's course, how Leonie Joyce edit started. started, was the Freakum Dress video. Mm, um, I remember that one. I went viral mm, on Twitter. Yeah, and it was so random because... I mean, everything you do, you're like, this is going to be the best. So every video I made, I was like, yeah, this is it. <laughs> this is the one. Um, and so I made that. And then next thing I knew, it was just going off until everybody was sharing it. Like people were reposting it that I follow. So that one, Can't Let You Go. Um, what's her uh, name? Steph London. Steph London. That one went big on Instagram. That one, Over 3 million views, is it? Something or two, two million. Two, uh, we round it up. Oh, <laughs> we round it up. Yeah, we round it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Five. <laughs> five yeah. yeah, that one was dope because I saw other people doing your challenge. No, no, everyone says that I didn't. I didn't make that oh, dance. Make that the was challenge. the actual dance for wow. the song. Yeah, I didn't she, she, make. Yeah, you got people are humble people. <laughs> if, well, like that, if she was Nigerian, she'd say, "Yeah, that was my dance." <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that to Nigeria. <laughs> you gonna let me go though? Huh? What did you do wrong? No, it's about to try to put some smart now. Oh, I'm joking. It's banter. <laughs> it's banter. You're just ignoring. So, Shade Room must have been big for you, being in a Shade Room. And obviously, I manifested that. I'm going to take all the credit. Um, how do you keep And you I will that? take that credit back. <laughs> yeah, yeah, thank you. Can you explain how you did that? No, I'm joking. No, I'm joking. But no, you did speak I did, to me the day before. The day before, say, oh, I told wow. her yeah, you're yeah, going to yeah. be on Shade Room. But next. it's no way. It's like Shut my. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's during our. Magic. Yeah, during our we chakras. Where was the magic? magic? I remember, I told you I was meditating. It was with these oh, man, yeah. and then I, I just had it in my vision. Stones around, and candles, and candles. Yeah, but it's also like you know you make vision boards. So I do it on this app called Canva. And then I save it on my, so it's my phone background and on my WhatsApp background. So being reposted on Shade Rooms there, it's been there for a year. Yeah. So I'm seeing it every day. So when no it happened, way. when they're going to repost you, they message you mm. and say, hey, can we repost this video? No and I was way. like, oh. So I was waiting, like, it may not happen because there's been things in the pipeline and it mm. falls out. So I was like, who knows? And then a few hours later, they posted Boom. it. Boom. And you're and there. Yeah. And that wow. was, Yeah. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, you know, we're going to get back to your successes in a minute because there's too many to talk about and unfortunately we, we don't have a lot of time, you know what I mean? Yeah, I because it. our producer over there has to go and eat, um, what was it, Yorkshire pudding? Who was, no, sorry, Uzoma. <laughs> no, Uzoma, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Uzoma's got to go eat. And sorry, sorry. I'm, no, no. <laughs> Uzoma's got to go eat. Production manager is going to eat snail. <laughs> <laughs> Uzoma Gusi. And then. And then. And then. So yeah, I was going to switch it real quick. Our topic today obviously mm-hmm. is how to approach women today mm-hmm. in this day and age, you mm-hmm. know what I mean? And holding men accountable. Mm-hmm. So obviously now you've gone a bit viral, not a bit, a lot. You've got over 40,000 followers on Insta, I think. You must be getting DMs. From guys? From guy, not fish. You must say not fish. <laughs> oh, I like that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I Oh, some of them look like fish. I'm joking, I'm joking. Speak your truth. Jokes, just jokes. No, apart from even just DMs, even... On the road, I'm sure guys approach you, all of that stuff. So I'm sure excuse you... me, can I talk to you for a second? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> They'll be like, hey, Goldilocks. <laughs> hey, hey, Goldilocks. Is he on it then? No. no I don't, 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 don't look all the way like Goldilocks. Goldilocks. No, 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 the locks. locks. Like, yeah. The locks. She's got locks in and they're kind of golden. When they you have to explain it, they always say when you have to explain it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 she's that's wearing gold. That's yellow. Yeah, no, oh, <laughs> just, just let it go. Yeah, just, just let, let it go. go. It went let over go. my head. <laughs> just let it go. Just don't worry. Okay. Don't worry. Okay. Apologies. <laughs> Apologies. Go on. Continue. Yeah, no, no. I'm just saying. Yeah, just adding to to Sukali's question. Yeah, just I'm sure not just on DMs. I'm sure on the streets everywhere you go. Obviously. So how do you go and finish your question? Yeah, so you must get a lot of attention, obviously. Even without the fame, you are a pretty young lady. Thank you very much. Are you single? Are you taken? And if you're not, if or you're not are you single, in a situation? <laughs> situation, an entanglement. How have you been approached since you've, you know, got this buzz around your name? Um, I feel like it's the same as how it always was. Oh, sorry. I've always been that girl, so... <laughs> yeah. It hasn't, you know. like, I, I don't feel like it's amped up or anything. Mm. But what I always say, I don't mm. know if it's the same for guys. Mm. I'll just speak for myself. It's not. If you, <laughs> exactly, facts, please. If you like someone, if whoever slides in your DM, if you like them, as long as it's not wild, whatever they say you're going to have. 
Is it? If you like them, you're gonna like whatever else that they say. There is a bit of a leeway. Mm. Like, you, so, like someone can give light. you the best. It goes back. It goes back to what I said to you, man, on the phone the other yeah. day. Remember what I said no, to you? I don't know if we yeah. talk about it. Do we talk about that now? Or do we talk about that later? Let's no, talk about it later. Let's okay. talk about it later. Mm. When women find a certain type of guy attractive, there's a lot they can get away with, innit? Like, mm. I'm gonna be in two hours late today. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Brandon. Brandon, <laughs> take your time. Uzi, what did Brandon do to I you? I know, right? Brandon goes in 10 minutes late to discipline us. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. Okay, but, so um, can you give me an example of what you would take if you liked them, but if you didn't like them, it would be too far? Yeah. Okay. That's a good one. Oof. Mm. Okay, let me she see has how to I think. Don't think. Just say okay, okay, it. I was just like, Joyce, one time I, I went on to not this one. Yeah. I, I went on to a podcast. This was like maybe even a year ago. Okay. And after that podcast, somebody messaged me and said, "I really like the sound of your voice. If you don't like someone, that's going to sound a bit creepy." Of course, oh, yeah, you're hundred percent. So if you like, I may have gone on that podcast with that person in mind. Oh. Ooh. Oh, and they weren't 16. there. They weren't there, and I was like, "Oh well, there goes that." But that person—I'm just gonna say it whatever. Yeah. That person was editing the podcast. Oh, I manifested it, and then he messaged me. So he must wow. have heard your voice over and over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Easy, yeah, easy. Yeah. Edits our podcast, and I'm sure if you hear someone's voice over, he no, gets I angry. Get that, I get that a lot, though. What do you mean? What she was saying, like, oh, your voice, your oh, voice. Relax, <laughs> you wait, know, wait. Was there. Yeah, we're not talking yeah, about what you. The hell? What the hell? I love that. Nah, I love it. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, let's box it. Do you like the sound of my voice when you're editing a book? Whose voice is wrong? Since you're trying, I'm hiding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Might as well. No one. But it's only it's only our pod that I really edit like that. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. All the other edits is probably got like background music in it. Okay, we'll leave that one. But just a quick question though. Yeah, I just wanted to ask. Um, so like, just your thoughts on. The way you're seeing things, you know, this current generation that we're mm-hmm. in, the way people approach women now mm-hmm. compared to back in the days, mm. do you think it's better now or you think it's just gone way? Do you think people are like taking it too far now in terms of like, do you know what I mean? I don't know. Maybe I'm not in the right scenes, but I feel like maybe it's more drawn back because before it was all out in the streets. People right. were actually going up to There people, you go. Yeah. Whereas now it's more online. Mm. So if anything, I think it's more tame. But then, right. I don't know, maybe if it's online, Look, do, people... Do you prefer feel... that or you... Um, I like both. I do like that in-person, getting right. to meet someone, mm. seeing if the chemistry is Of course is you there. do. Look how yeah. smiling. <laughs> <laughs> she loves it. Yeah. Yeah, no, but, I just wanted to get that, um, get, get, get your view on that, really. Mm. No, I think that's an interesting uh, question, Bo, because back in the day, obviously, I remember... <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> 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 I don't remember much you being there, but I remember we used to wake up and we'd go Cricklewood. Yeah. To approach girls. Just, and the whole day was just about yeah, approaching I, girls. Yeah, I wasn't there, nah. I wasn't there, you lost Yeah, yeah, yeah. Outside the barbershop. Yeah, outside the barbershop in Cricklewood. And we'll that just was a strip, wait, wait, yeah, wait for yeah. girls to walk. And that was like a day of it. We used to go to um, Chocadero. Yeah, we, we, we used to go to Chocadero. We, Chocadero. We used to make a place we had a role in Leicester Square. Yeah, man. Leicester okay. Square. And we'll just make a day of oh, going just go out to move to get to go how much yeah. numbers how many numbers can how many numbers yeah can get. Hyde Park, oh, Hyde how many numbers you can get you just walk up to go hey can i talk to you for a minute she'll be do you know what i mean like and even like carnival like mm. carnival will be a mad thing as well everyone will go there the number one aim is to wine mm. with as many right, girls and get as much numbers as possible. as possible so that might involve tapping on the shoulder when someone walks past you know Sometimes they'll be dancing, you just walk up behind them, you know what I mean? Or sometimes like, grab, grab the arm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like sometimes you grab the arm, mm-hmm. be like, hey, sweet one, come over here. Like, oh, my time, my time, my time. <laughs> my, si- my size, my size, my size. My size. Yeah. Whereas now, I don't think any man would even dream mm-hmm. of doing that, like mm-hmm. just dancing up, because I I, it seems now you could catch a case. That mm-hmm. could, you, you know, could, that you could seem as sexual harassment. So, I feel like everyone what has do you think now about that? understood that yeah. it was a bit wild like there's such thing as personal space and mm. that was being invaded but it was seen to be normal on mm. both on both parts yeah I would oh, say. yeah 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 um and now everybody's looked back at it like mm, yeah that's not okay actually mm. but i think also it's probably to do with age as well though because mm. clear, that probably still happening in school like with like 16 year olds you think seven. so with the younger ones yeah man there's, it's do you know what i'm saying but i think when you get to a certain age it's like you know fully what you're doing now, innit? Mm. Do you know what I'm saying to you? There's a limit. 
you got a lot to lose. You got a lot to think about. Like, nah, like that's not even worth it. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? And as, as I said to me, look, sometimes if I see like a female going into a lift by herself, I'm not going in. Not that I'm going in to do anything. Of course, but just you like, just don't want that. I don't want that. I love. Oh, no door closed. Mm. It was just mm. you and I in the lift. This, mm. and, I don't do it. Mm. I just don't go in the lift. So obviously you, know you mean? can dance, as we can clearly see. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Back it. Like, did you ever go to a dance and a guy comes up behind you? Did you like it? Did you not like it? Um, Were you one of those girls I would check first? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. I know what yeah, yeah, yeah. Then they continue. That's a bit rude, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, you know, the girls, they, they, she'll look at you too. first and she'll be like, okay, no, I okay, continue. Cool, cool, cool. Or she'll well, look for her friend, the signal, the friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then she'll move away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. she'll be like, is he all right? Is he good? Okay, cool. <laughs> Am I right? I've definitely done that before. But okay. I didn't start clubbing properly till second year of uni. Mm -hmm. So I'm well, about to be 20. When this comes out, I'm 29. <laughs> <laughs> So at uni, and when I was about 20, yeah. did I start actually going out? Uh -huh. And that wasn't the place where that happened. I went to uni in Derby, so it was very... Derby? Yeah. Derby? So more doof, doof. Yeah, doof, 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 Come like when man went well, <laughs> 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 Come on. <laughs> yeah. 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 No, and then no, when okay. I came back, uh -huh. um, I would only go to like Ugandan events, really, mainly. Mm. So... I don't know. I prefer talking in clubs. I don't know. Mm. I want to get to know them. In a club? With the loud music. With the loud music. Yeah. yeah. Like, excuse me. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, okay. Small yeah. Me, here and yeah. there. But yeah, get to know the person a bit. In a club. Mm. So you, do, you, do you purposely go to clubs to see if you can meet somebody? Um, yes and no. Like, I don't... I'll meet someone and I enjoy meeting them, but right. I don't care if I... Do. Don't see them, see them again. again. <laughs> okay. Wow. Right, wow. right, right, right. <laughs> no, because I've always just believed, boy, you can't go to, I, I've just always like, but you can't go to a club to meet somebody. No, mm. but I don't agree with that because you're in the club yourself. Yeah, you I'm in the club to go and have, worth... have fun. I'm not oh, trying you're not to, there to, to meet someone. Wife. No, okay. no. Are you not, so say when you were single, were you not someone that could be, oh, sorry, I just assumed, are you? No, I'm taken. Yeah, Very exactly. well taken. So say when you were single, were you not someone... That could be taken. You are taken now, right? Well, yeah. you're not worth being I in a relationship. Very well taken. Not, not, okay. So Maybe that's about my mindset. Like, back in those days when I was a lot younger, when I go to clubs, I'm going to look for a girls you can have, like, you know, one whatever fun with, whatever you want to call it. In but funky Buddha. I've never had fun with. And a baromba. Baromba. This guy's such an idiot. Yeah. But no, but I'm, I'm not going to lie, but I've just never seen, like, yo, I'm going to go to a club and meet a chick that I'm potentially going to have build my life. No, it's yeah. not necessary that you go there it's looking not the for that, scenario but it can me. happen. Not, which is true, which is true. If shoe. you're a decent person, there can also be another decent person there. In a club? Which yeah. Is, yeah, I guess. Kind of we have to find out what she was doing there. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. What if were you could, doing there? If, she, if we both came for a birthday party. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's yeah, okay. Yeah. Not that, oh, I which is, go which is like the case for me as well. Most yeah. times when I go, I'm not really the out-out person, but most of the time when I go clubbing for someone's birthday, for some event, whatever it is, I just thought, oh, yo, let's go clubbing. Let's go clubbing. So if you're really just going that. clubbing, you're not worth being in a relationship with. Wow. No, I, I, no, 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 no. If you put it like that, not for example. We don't need to look no, no, no. no, no. That's, that's a good point, by the way. But, but the point I'm making does, do you only go clubbing? Do you go, I'm sure you go to bars, you go to like restaurants, you go to like mm. events and yeah. stuff like that, right? Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. So I'm talking about the settings. That's all I'm saying. And I'm saying, yeah, I'd rather setting. be, yeah, I'd rather meet someone like maybe like a bar where it's chilled, where you can actually talk, talk. not shouting at each other when you're half drunk <laughs> and spitting each other's ears, bruv. Because that's literally what happens, bruv. Wow. Bro. I don't spit, bro. <laughs> no, people spit when no, they're, when they're half drunk. You should know what I'm talking about, bro. Bad just... man is spitting the ears, bro. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. But it's I'm not joking. to say that I go there looking, but because but yeah, there's happens. so much I look okay. for, yeah, yeah. I'm not closed off to where I'm at. No, that's true, though. Surely, if you're going to a club with an open mind that I may find my future mm. partner here, yeah. mm. you'd want someone that is good at dancing and that can whine. That uh, can, that can, wait, wait, yeah, that's what yeah, I'm saying. Yeah, wait, yeah, wait, yeah, 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 yeah. A lot no, no. of people I've dated can't dance. That's what, do you try to teach them? <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, like, are you sure, like, because I hear on the streets, I just hear on the Man's streets. on the streets. <laughs> that obviously, if a man can hold a good wine, then, you know, it goes down in the bedroom. Do you know what I mean? Okay. So, <laughs> so, 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 so. <laughs> it's not true it's not true mm. oh no, is that is that a proven sorry to fact? be disappointed <laughs> is that a proven fact <laughs> from some market <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, wow 
<laughs> wow. Oh okay, I gosh. thought you just want to... Okay, so if a guy came and whined behind you when you were dancing and you turned around and you liked him, would you let it continue? Or? Yeah, and if I didn't, nah. then it would be... Nah. So as long as you smile, nothing sounds rude. <laughs> <laughs> That's why she smiles all the time. That's why she laughed at your joke, by the way. <laughs> Even though it was dead. Uh, she didn't say that, bro. You keep trying to nullify my joke. Bro. She didn't say that. Nullify, big words. Mm, you like that? Thank you, thank you. You get that? Nullify. Uh, <laughs> French aid. French aid. We'll speak, we'll speak to production and management. Yeah, okay, I'll, I'll, yeah, yeah, off camera, okay. Thank I will you, lay out my complaints. Okay. Not <laughs> in front of the cameras. But yeah, move on. So, no Ted. do you not, not think that's a bit mad? Well, so, that means, so do one, you think dancing behind girls is wrong? Like, do I have to tap you first? Or it's not one shoe fits all now. Mm. Yeah. yeah so different yeah. sizes. Different yeah, sizes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. I agree with that. So if the if the guy is quite tantalizing, then <laughs> it goes in, innit? If it's not, so that's, that's man, they might just go to, you might as well just go to the girl and ask, like, can I get one? What do you think of me? <laughs> that's <laughs> dead. That's dead. Dead. You know what it's oh, dead. 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 You know what I mean? Dead. You have to handle this for a living. I don't even think that makes the whole situation more awkward. Do you know what? Do you know what? Maybe don't even no, if you if you want to ask, ask. Yeah. You know, consent yeah. is sexy. Um, <laughs> <laughs> said consent is sexy. Oh, consent is sexy. Uh, I like but that. If that's you've a new made hashtag. eye contact and oh, you've smiled, okay. that's somewhat of like an unspoken. Yeah, yeah, true. Uh, yeah. You know, wait, like, when there be times I went like, oh, I like his top. <laughs> <laughs> but, but you're not but, really like I like but him. You know, yeah. But really and truly, you, you most likely will know when you get tossed, yeah, you, though, it's true. you know like, the you get smile. The vibe, on, innit, you know yeah. what I'm saying? And what about in carnival though, where there's not enough time to smile across the room? I don't really. I don't smile across the room. Yeah, carnival. I've only been twice. You've only been twice, and you never. That's never my vibes, man. And you never hold a. No. You never broke it down. Broke, broke, broke it down. Broke, broke, no? Broke, 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 broke. None of that? It's okay. Kind of serious. No, because no, I'm trying to understand. Obviously, I, I, I don't even, even dream You're of doing something You're basically trying to like understand that. what's, accept, uh, yeah, acceptable what's acceptable now. Yeah, what's acceptable and what's not. Because yeah, 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 yeah. back in the day, when we were raving, that was definitely acceptable. We never even thought about it. You never like, even thought. You never yeah. thought of, you know what Especially I mean? Especially when that chill come on. Attitude, girl. Exactly. And all the girls were getting in the middle. You know what I mean? And they jump in the middle. I, I feel like a middle ground needs to be found because, as you said, if you got mm. someone to say, "Hi, I like the way you look," would it be okay if I whine? It's suffering. I feel like the mood is a bit. The mood is a bit. Because yeah. yeah. what she yeah. says, I politely decline. <laughs> <laughs> then it's all like long, do you know what it's I mean? Long, but then you can't just assume, assume. and go. So there needs to be a, b- a balance. Yeah, no, I hear that. I, I hear feel that. Like the eye contact, but it's the eye contact you're saying where you know you're both yeah, yeah, yeah. definitely feeling mm. each other, and then you go over. You might speak a bit. Then and you then you start to okay. yeah. don't get into the that. Thing is, the man is saying a lot of guys are not like educated on these clues. That's They're the not. problem. They're like not. they don't know about eye contact. It's about bro. I like that girl. I don't care if you, you make eye contact is. with me or not. It's like the foreplay of the dance floor. That's what it is. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> that is lit. Like yeah. That. Hey, you don't just end that. Eh? Some people you do need to... <laughs> But that is what a lot of guys yeah. are no, you can't no, do that. You have to no start now. with foreplay. Yeah, yeah. You, can't, you can't do that no more now. Foreplay That's what I'm on saying. the dance floor. Yeah. I like that. Mm. Yeah, Consent like is that. sexy, by the way. No, no, no. Yeah, that's it. So, have you ever been approached? Uh, in a way that was unacceptable to you in a, in, a, in a dance or any other place. Yeah. What was the scenario? Yeah. They just like grabbed my arm like that. Okay. Oh. I know girls hate that. Bro. Yeah. So even if he was sexy, you wouldn't like it. Hmm. Or is it, it, it depending on how soft the hand is? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. How aggressive yeah, the hand looks. Yeah. Feels like it does construction. You know what, actually, <laughs> construction <laughs> hands. Is it different? Or is it the minute hand, you, yeah. I feel for me, the minute I feel a grab. There's just so much that it's saying. So I don't care space. how you look. I'm just like, it's too aggressive. No. Successful yeah. to use it like a little, because a little, yeah, like, like a little, yeah, 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 a little rub, yeah. 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 Or a little and tap. then stop. Okay, and let stop. me acknowledge that you've oh. actually. Okay. Also, you like a little. Yeah. Uh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> let me just wait. Yeah, let me wait. <laughs> then she just re drop and now I'm mad at her friend. Yeah, yeah. And then you get a grin tip. Okay. So obviously. Another thing we want to talk about is holding men accountable. And I know one thing mm. that we don't agree with is when men used to like touch girls' asses. That one, I have never ventured into that situation. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what are you whistling for? Uh, <laughs> huh? Huh? Was that your forte? <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, I wish to live. No, no, no. I'll, I'll be real. Back in the day. In school. Yeah. In, this was in oh, secondary school. school. Oh, man. Yeah. This was a bro, thing like where... Bro, I've never done it. Oh, a, you were, oh, you were not there. That's when yeah. yeah. There was like a group with me. Oh, okay, let's see. The certain who girls in school. Talk, you know the top girls that... The, the top most, yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. Oh, who can grab whoever it is and run it? We grab and run. It's not like you grab and stay there. Sounds like, childish to me. It is. <laughs> well, we were child anyway. We were kids anyway. And it was wrong. And it was wrong. Very, very wrong. Into girls changing room. Very, very, very... No, I don't know about that one. No, no, I didn't do that one. I did not do that one. I, did, I was not involved in that Because you, you're yeah. a better man now. That was of wrong. Of course. That was wrong. So you run in there and then what? Everyone just running. Ah! They run like <laughs> <laughs> it was a But I didn't did remember the girls used to do it as well. Yeah, they we used to run the girls well. used to do it. Yeah, 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 no, yeah, our school was girls. Yeah, yeah, our school yeah, yeah. was girls. It was just like, yeah. But now, but very, you don't talk about back then, but now there's still no, men no, that will do that. They'll no, be in a rave no, no, and no. they'll. No, no, that's, a, that's an assault. That grown age, that's man. actually an assault, bro. Yeah. At this age, you can't do that. Why do you think guys still think that's okay? I think maybe they haven't changed the environment they were in and they've stayed in that same mindset and with the same sort of people. Yeah. Okay. And oh, uh, what was that? Quick drink break? No, <laughs> no, no. no. You, you, got, you got to top well, up, man. You know um, what I mean? Oh, thank you. You got to be yeah, filled up at all times. You know what I mean? A lot of men still feel like, well, if the girl's dressed a certain way, then therefore I can, you know, like look what happened with Swarms. I don't know if you lot saw no. a couple months ago where. No. Uh, I can't remember who it was accused, uh, a girl accused him of touching her breast. She, he just no, he just tapped it like that. Wait, are you sure? No, it was um, Swarms. Um, what's this guy's yeah, name? Yeah, yeah, um, he's ambush. Yeah, that's ambush. an ambush, bro. Yeah, and ambush. he apologized. My bad. Yeah, yeah, I apologize. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, apologize. it was not Swarms. Yeah, yeah, that's right. It was not. There you go. Yes, there you go. I apologize, yeah, yeah. Swarms. My bad. Yeah, yeah please. It was ambush. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ambush, ambush, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, ambushing Swarms. I don't know. Swarms. Like they both were doing bits in quarantine. They were. They were doing. Kind of got my yeah. Yeah, so she accused him of doing, I think on a video, on a dance, like, and that's, a video stuff, shoot that's stuff like that. that man would see, like, even during uni that time. Bantering. And they will be like, the girls, you know when girls wear this um, top that has no bra? The one with the... Yeah, it has no, yeah, and it's yeah. like the, the, the... And it just holds it yeah, up. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. You're talking about a corset or something? Yeah, yeah. No, 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 yeah. not a corset. Is it not? The other one, like, where it would look like... And it goes in the waist as well. Blazer, like a blazer oh, or like know, a top. Uh, you lost me, you lost me. Bro, and you, you look... Somebody help me. Oh, okay, wait, wait. They wear the blazer, but then no, it's not, Brett, you can literally no, just lift yeah, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. I know the way to want. Oh, as in like deep V. Yes, very deep. <laughs> very deep V. Are you sure is that's what you're That's the one I'm talking about because the one that and you, you can see like deep side, side <laughs> boobs. You can see like side boobs. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You can see the side boobs. And then a lot of men will be like, well, if it goes just a certain way, then therefore, da 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 da. <laughs> this guy. Why, why is position putting me? I'm asking a serious question. Also, it's go, not on, go, on, go on, go on, go on. What's it called? When it's deep V, it's more like plunge. Side yeah. Boob is there. This guy I'm saying, the guy says side Okay, boob, no, but you can add those two. <laughs> so even when a girl's wearing side boob, she's still not wearing a bra, right? Yeah. So that's yeah. what I'm saying. How do you know? <laughs> that's Shut a fact, up. To be fair, yeah, God. My point is, yeah. A lot of uneducated men yeah. will, a lot. will argue that because she's dressed a certain way, then therefore she's probably open to me. You know, touching the beaver. Like she's asking for it. Yeah, all of you that. You know, like stuff. sometimes women also wear that 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 dress, and there's no knicker. Yeah, it's you can got, see you all the way through the you side. You can see oh, all the way the through slit. the side. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Have- so certain uneducated <laughs> men will look at that and be like, "Well, clearly, if she's she's asking, if she's for exhibiting something. certain things, she's like, mm. what? What do you think about that? That argument, Does, that kind of mentality, yeah, of, think, your way of thinking. <laughs> so my initial thought of that mentality is mm. they're stupid and they're dumb, but at the same time. If I just say that, we're not going to have a change. You need to educate them and let them That's know why for. it is wrong. That's uh-huh. true. So, and some people don't believe it, but a lot of women do get dressed for themselves. Like, they like the look of certain things. Mm. Like that deep V, and if you have, like, maybe the breast is sitting up a bit. It's not for guys to see. You might just aesthetically like the way that that looks. Okay. In the same way, if you guys go to the gym and your pecs are sitting up a bit or something. I don't, why no, are they're you not quite like sitting that? up, but... <laughs> I'm, we're getting there. We're a work in progress, but yeah. But it's just for you. You just like how it. Looks I feel like most men do it for women. Most men do, do what? It. what their gym, legs? gym, yeah. gym. Yeah. Yes, really? back off yeah. their top. Yeah. Facts. Really? Facts. Yes. A lot yes. of things men yeah. do for women. Most things men do for women. Yep. You'd be surprised. A lot of guys are gangbanging all that stuff for women. Huh? Yeah. Explain. In terms of women like bad guys, so that that's why. Oh, gangbanging! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, 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 yeah.
But a lot of men do up bad because of women, so yeah. Because be women like black guys, you know the persona, all of the bad, mm, bad guys. I want that. a bad boy. Mm, mm. He has to be hand. If he ain't got three bodies, I, I, I don't want Do you know what it is? Uh-huh. Yeah. That's well, what, that's well, what, who said that again? Asian the brat. Yeah, when it, yeah. Okay, okay, you know what it is? You know what I'm going to, I'm not going to do though. The American girls, I'm not going to compare their mindset to the, they're on a different planet. They are, but even some girls over here still want a bad boy. No, no, 100%, yeah, yeah, 100%. I feel like, okay, yeah. You're saying the women dress up for themselves? Yeah, I mean, some women may dress for men. They're, I'm not gonna lie. There may has been a time where I'm like, there's gonna be guys there. I might want to look nice, catch their eye. You went on the podcast. Uh? I bet you wore the, the yeah, 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 nicest no, 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 dress, no, no, knowing no. that. No, I wore like long jeans, oh, a body. Okay. <laughs> a That's probably why I didn't come. <laughs> <laughs> he saw what's, you. What's she, see, what's she wearing? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, I ain't coming. <laughs> <laughs> but um, a lot of times it's for yourself. Like it's just, mm. I like the way this looks or it may even be, I just want to get a nice picture in this. Like it's, mm. it's all about aesthetically. I like how it looks. Okay. So um, one I thing I just want to say though, yeah, further to that though, but this is me. You know me, I like going back. Kind of, mm. yeah. I feel like also, do you think like women also, um, they're underestimating how powerful their body is? In terms of as a talk, like, because for me, again, if you look at like, I don't want to bring too deep into religion and stuff like that. Certain religion where it's just like, look, you got to cover up, talk to mm, 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 just mm, because mm. of the power of what a woman's body is. And again, obviously, yeah, you got guys like us who are educated and they know the right from wrong, what you should do, what you shouldn't do. But also you have men out there who aren't. And again, sometimes I think, I think for me, when I talk from the perspective of like, yo, I think... Yes, I do understand women sometimes for like your self-esteem, motivation, wherever it is, you might want to dress a certain type mm. of way. Just take pictures, like you said, for the good time, feel good. Mm. But however, there are men out there as well, when knowing in the back of your mind that there are men out there that <clears throat> don't necessarily think like the way we might do, Mm-mm-mm. who are essentially might see a skin of a woman and all they, they lose their head. Mm. All sense of wherever it is is gone. Mm. So this is what I'm saying sometimes for me. I just feel like also for women, I've always just had a mindset that there should just also be a balance and the awareness. Because it's, you know what I'm talking about? Like, it's like, imagine me as a guy, I'm, there's a jungle there. I know there's lions and wherever it is, but I'm just going to walk in there because you know what? I want to go to the jungle anyways. Mm. Mm. But I know there's potential I could get eaten. So I'm always coming with that mindset of like, that should also, it's important to also for women to have that awareness as well. Do you know what I mean? If, like, I got daughters and stuff like that. Like I'm going to raise them up in that way to be aware because... So yes, there are good men out there. Mm. However, there yeah, are men yeah. out there with bad, bad intention and you need mm. to, you don't want to make it easy for them. You don't want to, do you know what I mean? So mm. I always look from that, from that perspective. I don't know, is that wrong? or what do you No, think? it's not wrong. And I hear everything you're saying. I think a lot of women have the mindset of, I would rather that men are mm. taught, don't do that as opposed to us taught. Don't, don't do that. this so that you can stop yeah, them from yeah. doing that mm. in that ideal situation. Yeah. Yeah. No. So I, I I get where you're coming from and I see it. And there are instances where for me, I'll be like, it may be quicker to go home that way, but I'm yeah, not going to yeah. do it. Yeah, you know yeah, 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 yeah. Um, because yeah, you're, you're dark thinking, alley. Yeah, you're thinking about Because mm. oh. mm. in Uganda, I don't know how it is in Nigeria, but if you go to a certain part and you're dressed a certain way, they will literally yeah. undress you. Wow. Do you know what's so no, crazy? I I'll never forget. I wore shorts and they weren't even that short. They were like up to here. Mm. Walking down like, um, we'll just call it the high street. Um, <laughs> we'll just call it the high street. Uganda. Yeah, yeah, Uganda. Yeah, yeah, Uganda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the way they were looking at me, like I'm um, crazy and they're saying stuff like, Tosuala, da, da, da. Yeah. Mm. and I'm like, why are you looking at me like this when it's so hot and somebody's wearing fur boots and <laughs> nobody is looking <laughs> at them? <laughs> Like you're wearing fur boots. Fur boots. Fur boots. I'm wearing shorts in a hot country. Yeah, but yeah. That's the. It's know. the mentality. It's the mentality. Thing. It's like yeah. there's a lot of unlearning that needs to. Hundred percent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got a long way. Very, very long way to go. Honestly, yeah. what say you to that, Uzoma? <laughs> what? What he said? Yeah. I think this com- this conversation is just one of those long things, man. It's just. You, you, got like your you like you like you're tired. Not like, you know what? You don't know what to. You don't know what to do. Where no, to it's, go? It's a know. very like wild conversation, isn't it? And mm. obviously, you lot are doing a lot of talking. So I think for this one, I might just, <laughs> I might just have a Man little. I might, a no, no, no. I'm being real. I might just have a little like 
sit down in it. Do you know what I'm saying? Do you know, it's more word, listening. He said yeah, it's a very word yeah, conversation. Aspect, what conversation is not worded? No, 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 it's not. But I'm just saying in the aspect that you can never win these kind of conversations. Why? It? No, but it's we're not, not, no we're here to win. win. We're here it's to learn. Win. It's not, yeah, like, but there's also like, do you know what I'm saying to you? There's both parties. To Speak it, your mind. Speak your mind. Like for me personally, when I go out and I see a woman dressed in a certain way, mm. like especially like when you're talking about the whole thing, I just look at her like, you're attention craving and you're not my type of thing. Do you know mm. what I'm saying to you? So mm. that's how I look at it. Mm. But for some guys, mm. it's different. For mm. the fact that I'm like, okay, cool. I hear what you're saying. You want to look sexy. You want to look whatever. But there's no need for this, in it? Do you know what I'm saying? That's my personal like opinion. they're so doing too me, much. Yeah, like it's like you're just craving attention now, innit? Mm. Do you know what I'm saying mm. to you? Because I can speak for myself. I'm a guy. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying to you? But very rarely, like, I feel uncomfortable walking around topless. Mm. Yeah. And that's not because I don't like the way my body looks. It's just, like, it's just, I just feel strong. like, yeah, yeah. this is a bit too much. Like, let me just wear a vest mm. or something because I don't feel like I need to be all this, like, you know what I mean? Mm. Tattoo him here, put one fat tattoo guy mm. across here, my neck, you know, all yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Like, back off my top and I, mm. I just feel like there's no need for that, innit? Uh-huh. So I'm, I'm holding other people to my standards, yeah. in it like nah, okay. that there, that's fair enough. the whole dressing like you're just craving attention. I, I don't but, need but that. But you know what it is, you know though. What I'm yeah. saying? My thing is that might the way you you got your own standard. There's nothing wrong with that because that's your p- p- perspective of wherever that is. That's fine. But what my concern is is the other men out there that's actually looking to do yeah, yeah, something that's to that woman, behavior. and that's the one that mm. we're all. They're, they're trying to aggressively like, oh, excuse me they're, they're, they're. no like, I don't want you okay cool wait for her outside the club harass the girl those are the ones that for me I'm having problem with mm. does that make sense to have a prospect like oh that's not for me okay, so, so doing too much right, that's so cool. let, me, let me count that's that, cool yeah? I hear what you're saying yeah? but mm. again I can only advise people yes the world wouldn't exist if you never had good and evil in it there's mm. always going to be good okay there's always talk about evil, it yeah? mm-hmm. yeah. all I can say is I can only tell people around me like just make sure you protect yourself yeah, yeah, yeah. regardless mm. Mm. I can't now say oh you know what don't protect yourself because people need to learn it's just like man them you got a nice watch are you just gonna wear your watch to any regular regular place mm. I no. would hope so no yeah. I wouldn't I wouldn't want to but yes, again but I, I wouldn't what saying. I yeah, wouldn't yeah, yeah, not yeah. because yeah. I don't want to because mm. I'm just thinking you're being smart I'm just isn't it? gonna yeah. be walking with my watch in Dalston anyhow or, like, I might go to a spot and I think this spot is a bit mad. Man will just cover my watch. Uh, it's not being shook. I just don't want to... Street smart. Yeah, street smart. smart. In yeah. that situation, I can lose my life. In that situation, like, it's just not worth it. So, so I'll protect so myself. So what you're saying, saying is that... Same thing you're also, saying. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's yeah, essentially you're saying what I'm saying, people, basically. Yeah? Like, there is gonna, there's good and evil. That's just mm. the world, isn't it? That's what makes... So we can't be naive to it. Yes, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's so many, like, things I wear in videos, take pictures in there. But I won't leave my house. Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. And so. it's like, it's sad that it has to be that yeah, way. But that's like, just the way we live. Yeah, so basically, we can't be. We can't be naive. Like we would love but I'm women. Not, I'm not. But if people want to live the other way, do that's it. You. Yeah, yeah, that's you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like that, that's what we're trying I to say. I think we're trying to say we yeah. would love a world where women could wear whatever they of want, course, or nothing at all. Nothing at all. I mean, you know, some of us will be here for it. You know what I'm saying? But in the beginning, in, in the, the beginning, beginning, yeah, yeah, beginning. Yeah. Yeah. but I, I, unfortunately, we're living in a world where advice. there are creeps out there, there are men out there that will Creep. do the most. So we need to try and, like you said, have the balance. I was going to mm. say, actually, I was going to bring up the next topic, and I hope you don't mind. Um, mm-hmm. Obviously, there are certain things you wear on the instas and stuff like that that are <laughs> very, uh, um, very provocative, <laughs> Provo- provocative. provocative, and um, a lot of men. Because I was, I, I listen to quite a lot of American podcasts. You know, them men yeah. do a lot, mm. and they say when they see females on the gram doing stuff like that or twerking, mm. they will send an uns- unsolicited picture to them. Uh, I don't want to say what it is, but the D-pic. Wow. Yeah, the D-pic okay. and stuff like that. Uh, what, what, what do you think about that whole phenomena of mandem just sending unsolicited Unsolic- pictures? I think it's very weird. It's very <laughs> wild and very, weird, yeah. Mm. It, first of all, it's just weird. Nobody asks for it. And then it's <laughs> like, what? It's like, oh, Thank you. Like, what do you say? Fake, yeah, what do you respond so back to that? It's mad, isn't it? It's, I mean, what? So I'll listen to one American. I forgot what his name is, but he said, "Listen, dog. For me, for every ten dick pics I send, I get at least one girl hit me back." So it's like 
That's his, that's his mindset. Like, and that's what I was going to say. Yeah. It must work for them yeah. to keep doing it. Yeah, there must be women out there but that are you know what that is, crap. Yeah, you know what that is? Yeah? You got to remember with life, yeah? I think we try to pick and choose where to apply certain <laughs> pressures. Mm. You understand? I just feel like, yeah, life moves around the kind of energy you feed out, innit? You mm. know what I'm saying? Mm. So if I'm feeding the energy that this is the kind of vibe I'm on, mm. I'm going to attract that energy in it, regardless of if it's right or wrong, innit? Mm. Do you know what I'm saying to you? So it just keeps going back to the same thing of everybody should just protect themselves, innit? Do you know what I'm saying to you? No, but yeah, I hear what you're saying. But again, to fully answer that question from yourself, anyways, mm. I want to hear it from you. Like, have you had any of that before? Yeah. Have you I'm, had guys send I'm you... I'm not going to speak for everyone, but I feel like the general consensus, we don't want to see that. I'm going to yeah, be honest. Of course. We don't... Yeah. Why do you think guys do it though? I don't understand. I really don't. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. I think there's more on a woman's body that looks nice to send as mm. opposed to the guy. We don't, we don't have yeah. much. <laughs> we, don't have much. <laughs> we don't have much to send or. Eh? So I, I don't get why they do it. I've never understood it because personally, I just don't feel like I want anyone to have that on me. Do you know what I mean? That I've got mm. yeah, 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 Melinda's yeah, yeah. dang dang all up on my phone and any moment all, all I do. Internet. Yeah, all up on the internet. Any moment you do something and then, ah, it's just really, I, I, I don't, you know. Guys I mean? just need to stop that, man. It's nasty, yeah. man. So nasty, like, nasty, nasty, I mean, not nasty. trying to be all up in your business again, mm. but have you ever tried online dating? No, oh, that's yeah. not even what I was. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. 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 And have yeah. you ever had any bad situations on like any catfish. bad approaches on? on I haven't dating? had a catfish, but I've okay. had I've had a lot of bad. I've had a lot of good. Like I'm a big advocate of online dating. Like, okay, I got into a relationship from it. Oh, from Tinder, wow. the one that everybody looks down Listen, on. Listen, I'm signed. Wow. I'm signed to Bumble. Please, we can't we can't mention Tinder. We can't. Yeah. Oh, no. sorry. I'm, I'm joking, on I'm Bumble joking. as well. I'm joking. I'm joking. Are you on Bumble as well? You what was all the, of them? What was the bad situation? Um, or, or can you give us an example? I've just been on like some bad dates. Like there was one guy. Yeah. I remember he was just, his pictures, he looked like his pictures, but he didn't. Ooh. And I remember I was, I could see him from a distance. And you know, and you're like, you want to turn around. So catfish. I, I had called him like 10 <laughs> seconds before to say, I'm walking up to the station. <laughs> so I couldn't leave. You couldn't leave. So like in, we were like in the Waterloo area. And the the clock struck, uh-huh. and so I heard it. I was like, "Oh wait, what's this? Oh my god, I've got to go." <laughs> Cinderella, you tried to do Cinderella. Cinderella. <laughs> I took off your shoes and ran. Did you took off your shoes and ran. Did you leave your knee high <laughs> in Waterloo. But That's yeah, mad. I've had, and then I've had. <laughs> nah, this is listen. Funny, it's a safe place. I want to hear it. Yeah. Okay, so um, okay, they were both online. Okay, how do I start the story? <laughs> no, this was uh, this was uh, yeah. I mean, okay, forward. so I was newly single, uh-huh. and I was like, I don't know if I'm ready to date. Uh-huh. There was someone I had dated before uh-huh. from online dating, so we went, we went on a date to a place. I'm not gonna say the place. Um, went there, and then the day before, I had gone on Tinder, and I matched with someone. And I was like, this guy looks familiar, and I had matched with him a few years ago Mm -hmm. and he was still following me on Instagram so I messaged him we got talking the Uh conversation was flowing and then I said something and he was like do you know what this is a conversation we should have over some wine or something bars (laughs) (laughs) and then he he was saying tomorrow and I was like how do you know I don't have plans tomorrow Yeah. and then he was like I don't know I said I do and he was like well you'll be on your date but you'll be thinking of me oh yeah energy (laughs) so I was on the date yeah. Uzi's taking notes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I don't need to take notes. I'm a G. G. Mm-hmm. And I was thinking, thinking about Uzi. him. Oh, and wow. also, I'm going to be 100% honest. Mm. I look really good. Okay? I mean, and the yeah. date was coming to an end. So I was like, yeah. somebody else should get to see Bro, <laughs> You know that you wear an outfit and you don't feel like it got enough. Uh, you like, yeah, you so like, I, like, need, I need to I wear need it more. again. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh. So then I messaged him. I was like, okay, I'm going to be leaving Charing Cross, coming up to London Bridge if you can be there. Da, 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 da. Uh. So he came. So we went on the date, blah, blah, blah. It was great. Then the other guy, he had been trying to meet up with me. And it was just, we kept missing each other. And I just thought, do you know, I already said I wasn't looking for anything serious. I thought he would get it. Next thing I know, <laughs> I get a comment on one of my Instagram posts. It's one of the ones where I look happy. I'm, jump- <laughs> I'm jumping in the sky. Yeah. And then he says, and he comments, 
how can you reach out to me? And then you're not replying to my messages. What? Da, 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 da. Hashtag fake nice. Oh. <laughs> on, on one... <laughs> yes, I deleted that quickly. <laughs> the other guy. So things were going good with him. I, okay, do you know, I like like, like rom-coms, all of that. Sometimes I get caught up in the moment. <laughs> <laughs> so one time. We had a so you just be out here playing games with these guys. I told gone. you. We had bad. a good day. Wow. And bad, then you know. he he left me in his house and he went to work because I didn't have to start till later than uh-huh. him. Yeah. And so I was like, do you know what? I had a good time. I'm going to like do something nice. So I wrote, I wrote a really nice note, like on a letter and sprayed it with my perfume. Because <laughs> <laughs> oh, I knew he got that and he really liked that. So then he wow. planned a really nice date for me, like... It was a, what's that thing called? A scavenger Picnic. hunt. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So he wrote like clues and riddles and I had to guess where we're going. So first went to like Dinorama in Shoreditch, went there for, because you were like rosé, had rosé. Then he took me to. Wow, Hoxton guys, we really be Square. having time to plan stuff like this. Oh, huh? We watched the sunset. Just step up my game. You are old school, man. <laughs> Blue's Kitchen. He you booked up the table, man. watched the band play. And it was it was really nice. I had a really good time. And then we went to XOYO, really good. But it's then really tough in, out one here. in one <laughs> day, all these things I'm hearing, just like it's tough out Honestly. here. That's what I'm hearing. But go on. But then he was trying to want to be exclusive. Okay. Uh. And I'm newly single. And no, I had a day serious. on Monday. <laughs> And the other day on Monday, man's taking you dinner on my EXO, oh, Blue's Kitchen, pulling out all the all the stops. <laughs> so and I felt like how, in in the moment I was like, should I lie and say okay? Then I was like, why do I feel like I'm about to be a cheater and I'm newly You're single? The, yeah, yeah, yeah. This isn't making sense. And he was doing a lot of like, I felt emotional manipulation, yeah. red flags. Like I was his source of happiness. So I ended up having wow. to cut it off. But it wasn't even straightforward, and then he kept calling me. I had to keep cutting it off after, and oh. and that was all through online dating. So yeah, I've had wow. that's so bad. Not bad. Okay. And you see, when I say to you, man, oh yeah, <laughs> if I invite the girl out, I'm paying. <laughs> <laughs> There's multiple outings. You're just one of a mill. That's <laughs> mad. Um, You're one of the mill. No, 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 no. I'm happy to pay on dates. No, no, I'm as not well, saying you don't on dates, but I'm just saying, okay, one There's of the different good dates. One of the good dates. Okay. Okay. That sounds good so, to me, though. It, that For was, her, it was. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was up there. I'm talking about one of the ones that actually both parties walked away happy. Mutually happy. So, one of the people I met online ended up being my boyfriend. Oh, okay. So, that was good. He's not how my long, boyfriend. How long but did what? that last for? Sorry. Um, we met in 2017, ended 2019. Oh, oh that's, that's not bad. Okay, it could have been a success story. Yeah, it could have. It, it I could've mean, been. we can call it one. You yeah. can still call it that. Yeah. That's not but bad. But I want a bad experience on the approach. So not just, you know, you using him for a nice... No, I didn't I'm use I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. I'm joking. Nice. But do you have a bad approach that you've had online dating? Like the first sentence was... Like, whoa. Like, you look nice for a dark-skinned girl or something. Oh, something. I haven't wild. had that, to be fair. Okay. But I did go on a date with someone and he he was a police. Um, <laughs> Federal. <laughs> he said he would have voted fam. for Trump. Um, he, she what? He, he would have voted for Trump. Did she not say, look, he I'm hated going carnival. to and He hated carnival. Yeah, he's like, oh. What, a he couple hated times. the Black Lives Matter movement. Like, oh, it's happening in America. Why are they doing it here? Um, so, is it a white guy? <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say, can we just get to that? He yeah. drove a moped. It just, um, okay. Oh, no, he drove a no, moped. I'm thinking Turkish. Was it a Vespa? <laughs> I'm thinking Turkish. I didn't. Caucasian? Yeah, 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 okay. yeah, okay. yeah. Okay. That was, but do you know what? I'm glad I went on that day because it's a great story to tell. It wow. was so yeah. unreal. So I felt like I was being punked. Literally, I was like, he was literally stopped. waiting for cameras to come out. At the end, the cherry on the top he even said, you know, obviously, my last girl. She was black, and you know, once you go black, you don't go back. And I was oh! like, oh my god, get me out of here. Get I mean, me did out. he lie? Did he lie? <laughs> no, get me out of here. Go back, go he back, go was, back. Why does this exist out here? That I is couldn't wild. believe it. So when he said Black Lives Matter, what was your face reaction? Did you come back to that? You're or? smiling, man. No, do you know when you're just in shock? Because this was like, this was. This was even before 2017. Mm. So it was those marches back oh, then. The start, yeah. yeah. So imagine you lot were together. What would the conversations be like now? That statues? Would you see their throwing down statues, Joyce? <laughs> throwing down statues. Oh, that's our proud history. <laughs> <laughs> I 
couldn't believe it. Okay, oh I think that, that does kind of top the bad situation. No, that is, yeah, yeah, it does. No, um, my gosh. I wanted to discuss two more things quickly before mm. we wrap up. So, obviously, we touched on in the beginning about, you know, if a man's good looking, there's certain things he can get away with. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, I just wanted just to hold on that a little bit in terms of, hmm. do you think that is fair? Do you think that's why the lines are so blurred to man them as to what is okay when you're approaching Very a woman? 100%, point. because... Adding to that, I was saying to the man, them like, bro, I saw a post on like, shy man, made you think like, yeah. the um, the other time he posted something about like, oh, two like a pop picture of like two guys, one of them obviously like the guy is not nothing to write home about, isn't it? Yeah, like, do you know what I mean? Not keen on the eye. Yeah, no, yeah. The thank you, I yeah. like that. Thank yeah, you, yeah, thank yeah. you, thank you, Sakali. And then, the, <laughs> and then the second guy, obviously, you have this buff kind of like. Muscle Mostly, build, the everything. Gym guy yeah, to the eye. Yeah. The PT, the PT. Thank you, thank yeah. you, thank yeah. you. Yeah. you. And yeah. Yeah. There's um, muscles where you've never seen muscles before, all of that, you know. And it's like, you get one of them is, um, then it's put like a caption, like, one of this is, oh, that's cute. And the other one is um, sexual harassment kind of like thing, innit? Mm. And then, obviously, the kind of thing behind that is like, if the not so keen to the eye guy is like, oh, oh, excuse me, you look so beautiful, darling. It's like, oh, go away, man, move away. Kind of like, mm. you know, mm. the reaction. But with the other guy, like, oh, thank you. Da, 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 da. So, you know, you have that. I think just to add to Sakali's yeah. thing, and then that's kind of like, mm. but why is that? Why though? is that? Why should, Why is it not consistent? Co- yeah, it's not consistent. There's no consistency, mm. man. There is, I feel like it's just like, I was talking to my friend about it on the phone today. I was speaking to him and I was saying, I have a friend, you'll see him on the weekend, Armani, and he's very, he can say a lot of, problematic things okay. and I'm always nervous when I bring him around people I like like a bit different people uh-huh. I'm always nervous when I bring him around people but every time he everybody always loves him yeah. and my friend was like it's because he's pretty it's pretty privileged okay. that's what it is oh, pretty privileged even even just amongst okay. other guys even like, like if if you look if you've got and he's got a bit of an accent if you just if it's packaged better People are more willing to take it. I think that's, that's what it is. Crazy. Is that fair though? That's what I'm it's saying. It's not fair. But so our unpretty fair? brothers are here struggling. Struggle. Yeah. Cannot speak their mind, didn't it, Uzi? Must be the one who's here. Boy, this guy's sending shots at you today, fam. You don't worry, we'll get, we'll get back next no, week. We'll get back next she's, week. She's the headmaster of yeah, let, pretty let, privilege. Let, let, him will, have it, let him have it this week. She'll let give you a pretty privileged pass. Don't worry, it's okay. But no, no, in all seriousness though, I just don't think it's consistent. I feel like. It should be guys, guys. Let's be serious. <laughs> what do you mean? Let's be serious, bro. <laughs> this is you, bro. You're taking a piss, bro. I don't blood. agree with what he's saying. Yeah, exactly. Thank you. There you go. And, and that's all that matters. Is that's it? all that matters. Isn't it? I'm yeah. not going to answer you. You don't because <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a G. Fam. You are no, G, and you are a fine boy, no pimples. Fine boy, no pimples. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. You're the. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. No, but for real though, I feel like there needs to be. Obviously, I know it would probably never happen. Never. I think because the lines are so blurred. Certain man will see certain man doing something, they get away with it mm. because of the pretty privilege. Mm. And then when they try to do it, then it's, ah, oh, you're doing too much. Mm-hmm. Is it, are we just doomed? Is this just how it's going to be? It seems like it. I thought, yeah. yeah. Life, Life is never going to be fair. No, but one thing I, I would fair say, enough. though, yeah, just to add to a little bit, for the guys out there in inside, I think making an effort in terms of your appearance and stuff like that, I think can it help. definitely can. No, not, it, it will yeah. help. Because I do feel like, Bro, we got guys like I know people like you know not so keen. You might want to say whatever, but I mean, Ruben Studdard was out here. Everyone was singing his song. Just you know I'm saying yeah. to you, but no, uh, no, oh, oh, okay, okay. Bro. <laughs> no, right. yeah. they, they, they cancel that. But then, bro, like in terms of when it comes to like yo styling, mm. the way they dress, and then mm. apart from that as well, the way they talk, like carry you know, what I'm talking yourself. about the way you carry yeah. yourself, all of that, it just makes up for everything else, and mm. people just see beyond that. So again, I think that's important. But you can't just be all ah. You know what I mean, innit? Mm. So you got to make some sort of effort, innit? That's what so I mean. So if we were in Westfield mm-hmm. and you were just coming out of Bershka. Mm. Bershka. 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 Can I be like, yo, my time? Oh, oh, definitely. No? 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 Okay. No. Come on, man. No. Maxi, well, how, how, would you, how would you move to a girl if you were single in today's age? What would you say? <laughs> Come on. Know, let's let test it. Let's see if it's acceptable. Was, you know? let's, see, let's see if it's acceptable. Mm. I don't know. I haven't been on them things in a long time. Okay, D, D, I don't talk to girls. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Neither do I. I don't move to girls, but I'm just saying. No, but I'm being real. I'm, I'm okay. actually no, no, no. Okay, no, okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. It's fine. It's fine. So you, get, what, what would you say? 
No, obviously. So I would obviously like be like, excuse me, can I can I take a few minutes of your time? Oh, but that's we all do that. <laughs> <laughs> but I just asked you, and no, you guys said you don't. I, I don't that. want to say that because excuse that's, me, can I talk that's to regular degular. Yeah, that's not so how, 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 how would you like to be approached if you are outside? Would you like to be approached if you're outside? I mean, that's fine. And mm. again, I would just assess how the person looks. Okay, and what if you're with your friends? Because sometimes the friends be be hating. Do you know what I mean that? No, I, I, I don't, I don't care to what the that's like, like, oh, yeah. I'm the only one She got a man of her own. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Okay. No, take this that's off lovely. That. That's yeah. lovely. But it's also about the confidence as well. Okay. Because yeah. I've been confidence. approached. That there is something about the air of confidence. Like you could just take a picture of them in that moment and know Ooh. they smell amazing. Oh. Do you see what I mean? So wow. the perfume yeah. matters. Yeah. You know the chest up in the air. Yeah. Who told you this? Look at the producer. Check this out. Who told you this? You know when I try to say to Baba, I don't really talk to girls like that. He's not deep. I just I'm spray, I just it. spray the perfume no, and then all I talk. I hear beat. Get out of here, man. Deli- delivery, you okay, know what what's I mean? Okay, what's your favourite uh, odour? I, I, I don't know. No, I don't know. Odor, when yeah, she smells it, she knows. She knows, you know, okay. The, Vibes. You, you it's like all the, about comment. <laughs> the thing is, I don't have a set type of how people look mm-hmm. either. Like, the people that... Yeah, we know. <laughs> we know. The they spectrum is very wild. Which is the spectrum? The spectrum of her ex-boyfriends are very wild. Is it? Yes, but it's okay. Wow. In, in, this is this is. Inclusion. Wait, you're saying ex-boyfriends? Like I've had okay, many. Okay, not boyfriends. <laughs> not boyfriends. <laughs> I've had like one. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Apologies, but um, what um, people have liked. He yes. dated. Yeah, dated. She's very inclusive and diverse. <laughs> but that, that's good, though. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's okay, good. so basically, respect. Uh, approach me in a respectable manner. Mm-hmm. Have confidence. Have then you can talk to me when I'm in. Have source. In West yeah. Yeah. Have that. source. Don't, don't discount that. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Have have actual Heinz tomato sauce. Heinz. Not not Sainsbury's value. No. No, we don't do that. Don't. And then on the flip side, very quickly before we close, obviously like I'm all here for, you know, protecting women and stuff, but there's been times when men have been falsely accused of, you know, approaching women in a one way or sexual assault and stuff like that. Uh I think there was even one case, right, that I was reading about. Let me quote this so you can see her name is uh Gemma Bill. She you know, she claimed she made some mad accusations, even one man got sentenced. Seven years in prison, he served three before being released when they found out she was lying. What do you, why do you think, obviously you can't talk for her mm. or that situation, but what do you think about that when a certain man get falsely accused of things like this? Because you can't take it, but even when they're found not guilty, yeah, mm. there's another thing I wanted to add to that, like, it's still, you, there. It's still it's out there. And, uh, yeah, because he still look at you kind of like, mm. he spoke and to the news with younger and he brothers, said, I'm like that. Exactly. And that's why I really don't like, um, I don't agree with women hitting men. Mm. Yeah. Because don't hit anyone. Because mm. someone yeah, might that's hit me. you back. Yeah, like, don't, hit don't, no one. don't hit anyone. Mm. And like, especially having a younger brother who now like he's all good. Mm. But when he was younger, he had a temper. Mm. So it, he didn't care who you were. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> mm. So it's like, I'm very like protective of that. Okay. And there is a double standard there, which I really don't yeah. like. It's mm. like women can hit men and it's fine. I really don't agree with that at all. Mm. Especially because mm. then... If a guy does something which he shouldn't, uh, obviously. shouldn't, yeah, of course, Never. yeah. But he's now the bad guy, and she didn't do anything. Mm. So yeah, no yeah, one right. should be hitting nobody. Nobody it's as simple hit as that. Anybody, yeah. yeah, everyone keep their hands to themselves. Yeah. So what can men do to protect themselves from being falsely accused? Don't go in the lift with women. <laughs> <laughs> that's I was talking to my that's brother, and they were telling me stuff way. like. If they're walking behind a woman, they'll cross over the yeah, other side. I was going to say that. I do that all the time, especially when it's stuff, a bit dark and I just cross the other it's side. It's crazy the stuff you have to do. Like, it's, it's sad that we even have to sit here and list these things out. Unfortunately, um, we've got to do it. And I think on the flip side here, yeah, a lot of men have been in like mad situations as well. I think like that's the problem because I don't know if I've told you lot this story, yeah, but when I was, um, I think, 12. Mm. Do tell. Yeah? Mm. I, had a, I had a neighbour. This mm. was in nine, yeah? Mm. And literally, like, she was funny. Like, I used to see, like, men go in and out the yard, whatever. <laughs> yeah. mm. So one time I ended up there. Yeah, <laughs> what? Like, on my ones, innit? On yeah. my ones. Obviously, she had man on her lap, like a baby, innit? Yeah. How old is she around this 12, time? 11, oh, okay. 12. Yeah, and she lipsed the madness out of me. She, this, I'm talking big woman. Oh, my God. Yeah? Mm. But when that happened, even to this day, like it ain't traumatized me in any way. I just thought, ah, oh, man's a man, like yeah, I'm a big woman. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Like, yeah, that's yeah. how men glorify like these uh, things. But like, it's a piss thing. Is it? Yeah, it is you a should, that should not be happening. Like, even yeah, though it yeah. didn't, it didn't affect me like mentally. But I'm just saying, like men do end up in mad situations as well. No, nah, yeah. you just think like, oh, it's nothing. I can't come out now and tell you, man. Like, imagine like. I was on a night out. Three girls just handcuffed me and just mm. done it. I wouldn't come. 
Bro, you think screen. you could go to police station and say, yeah, oh, I wouldn't even laugh but that's that. a, I wouldn't even yeah. do it because I, it would just be funny. It's embarrassing. Like, oh, yeah, yeah. It, was a, it was an epic night. No, I can whatever. definitely relate. You know I guess for men, we're That's happened to me as well, you know. Yeah, so it's like, we don't take it serious. So we need to also encourage men I want to hear. No, no, Uzi, fight you just, for their right. yeah. you actually just inspired me to speak of, my truth. It's happened to a lot of men. Let's hear Sakali's truth. Why are you saying it like that? <laughs> Dog, I'm not. No, I'm, I'm interested like, to hear. I was at summer camp. You know, back when I was younger, and summer camp. Yeah, I, I got sent to summer camp. Obviously, I was a, I was a bad breed. But um, yeah, yeah and I just woke up to this, 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 this female woman like riding on top you. of me. Do you know what I mean? Riding you. Yeah, and I'm like, wow. like a horse. <laughs> You know what? Let's not, well, I don't want to laugh about it because yeah, yeah. I was underage, bro. Like I was actually How 15. Was you? But for men, yeah. it's like for you us, 15. I was 15. Mm. But she, uh, it, but she was over age. And that's what happens. This is what this is why I can't tell the man. That's what I said. We're trying to encourage men. Like this is why I can't tell the man. because we, when it when it's the other way around, it's I'm crazy. The, I'm the problem. But when it's the man, then it's like. <laughs> Bro, why are you complaining? It's so it? Yeah, like, yeah, bro, it I wasn't. Did, it was, I did not yeah, consent. I swing the wrong way. Mm-hmm. So what, what, what was you? your reaction when that was? Bro, done? I just what kept quiet you? and let her finish what she was doing, and then. Oh, what she you had, was doing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, bro? She was doing what she hey, was doing. Don't do that. She and was then, doing okay, what she was doing. What did you do after that? Nothing, bro. I just, bro. Did you tell anyone? No. This is like the first time I've had this it. No, but wait, wait. How did it bro, make you... Bro, come on, bro. Wait, wait, wait. How did it make you feel, though? Nah, the maddest thing with me is I'm a sensitive guy anyway. In terms of touching me, like, you can just touch my knee and I'm, I'm good yeah, to go. Do you know what I mean? So... <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. I'm not. I'm not. I'm you very, like... Man. I'm very... So, for me, it was one of those things where you might think because... I was still up. I yeah, was enjoying no, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I wasn't. I was very, very. So you like, wasn't enjoying it. I was like, yeah. were you up because you wanted to urine? <laughs> or you were up because you were. <laughs> hey, this guy. Stop making light of this situation. This is a very, this is a very serious, serious situation. situation. The point I'm trying to make is, it's just that like, I did not feel like I was allowed to feel. Mm. Do you get it? I felt like it is what it is. You're a guy, and this is what. But That's crazy, though. And we haven't spoken. Yeah, like we haven't. You know, almost like do it you, didn't happen. Do you still know the person? Or? Yeah. Person, Swear, yeah. My so one, now, my yeah. one. I left that behind. How, that person. No, I'm how, never, I don't. Old, I'm not that I talk to that person. How old were they at that time? Do you know? Like roughly? 17, 18. And you was fifteen. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, bro, that's still mad, bro. It, my, your one is, is mad. It's my mad. one was no, a grown it's mad, woman. It's Let's mad put it in today's it's mad, context. Yeah, yeah, it's Come mad. On. Because it's mad. The, here's the mad part of it, about it is that obviously. Consent. There's no consent. Like, yeah. Just, yeah. yeah. So Man was means, again going back to Uzi's point and both of your point. I feel like with men, don't again, say both is different. Mine was a grown <laughs> woman. She had me on her lap yeah, like a. Was, <laughs> okay, <laughs> cool. Like you a. Was, yeah. still, no, 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 no. But still, there was, was no consent. There was no consent. Her name was so I think that's the key thing here. <laughs> her name was Lovinda. <laughs> Lovinda. She loved me. She <laughs> loved me. Lovinda, shout out you, you But but the key thing to pull out of this is that the consent part. Why? Yeah. Why is it different though? And men are conditioned, yeah, and this to, to like, accept that. You tell me, because in my head, the way I see it, it's not different. Yeah. But I see so many people view it as different. Mm. Like when we cut, I'll talk about something, and okay. there's a situation mm. that I feel so strongly about that people feel very differently about, mm. and it's like it was equal. Mm. Like the minute a guy does something whatever the girl did is cancelled out it's cancelled yeah. out you know yeah. what you know you know what i think it is yeah because i was having this conversation with someone the other day yeah, and i said exactly what you said where i don't think any woman should hit a man yeah mm. one thing i think god gave men is just that physical power in it you know mm. what i'm saying in terms and of you just can't take that away that's you know what i'm saying and in terms of women obviously what he gave them was obviously their mouth mm. that's how they can actually man said their mouth no no that's, that's what they've hilarious. got we've got the physical strength they've got that they can actually mm. a woman can say something you down that will put that will push your butt right there. yes that's like, what i'm saying that's, that's the power that god gave them whatever mm. yeah but I just feel like with that, it's one of those things where like, whether it's a grown woman or not, like a woman that's probably like 40 and I'm probably like 15, 16, like there's not, she can't like physically, like, I don't know if that makes mm. sense. Like, so it's seen as bad. Like, you're, yeah. you're but, more like... No, 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 to, to so, add to that as well, with me, to add to that as well with me, the way I've just always looked at it, unfortunately in life in general, there are always going to be certain imbalances. Like, yes, where yes, yes. Some yes. of them goes, works mm. in the women's, um, favor favor and then some of them vice versa because if you think about it, if you look at it right i've always looked at it, especially the scenario you both of you spoke about and i feel like that's what's kind of shaped men's um society in terms of how we look at situations like that when you look at it right from 
primary school, women have always been had someone chasing them. Mm. Always. You've always had either this boy, whoever it is that's liked you, do, 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 all the way through life, you've had men chasing you. Mm. So you are conditioned to know. Duh, 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 duh. Does that make sense? Mm. Men, we've just been... Uh, maybe there might be like a select few, right? That's might have had women chasing them, but most in most cases, we're the one doing the chasing. Mm. Does that make sense what I'm saying to you? So it's almost like yeah, to go and talk to chased. another man that, oh, this girl come and did this to me. The way they're receiving it is like, hmm, you should be happy that or you, you should be lucky yeah, yeah, that yeah, you yeah. had someone to just... Mm. So that's the re- so to me anyway, that's the kind of like mentality band. That doesn't make it okay. Mm. But I'm just saying that like, to me, that's maybe... That's why I'm mad and think that Yeah, way. yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I get that. I get that. But for me, it's like, I want to enter where I want to enter. I don't want to be You don't want somebody... Yeah, yeah. I don't yeah. Want to be Nobody to does. Yeah, them, 100%. But, um, I appreciate that. Unfortunately, we actually have come to the end of the show. Yep. I feel like we could have gone on forever. So that means... Forever. Have, it's finished. The drink is finished. <laughs> <laughs> there, was, there, was, there, was, there was a drop. <laughs> I saw there was a drop. 100% there was a drop. Yeah. <laughs> no, but Joyce, you've been so open, so honest, and I've appreciated it. I feel like there's so much things I could have touched I on, but there wasn't yeah. enough time. It's all right. We'll but thank you for back. being open thank and honest about your me. journey. Can you tell people where to find you, what you got coming up next, all of that, all yeah. of that? Yes, um, you can find me everywhere, Leonie Joyce, L-E-O-N-I. J O Y C E, that's YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, TikTok. Twitch. No, I'm not on Twitch. No, no, okay. no yeah, yeah. Facebook, okay, cool. uh, Snapchat. Brand me. Oh, what? Okay. Yeah, Did you approach her man or what? Copyright. I'm joking. Yeah, I'm joking. Music, copyright. copyright, yeah. Cool. Mm. Lucky you didn't get banned on Insta then. I know, thank God. Very lucky. That's good. Thank okay, God so, for reals. Mm, thank God for reals. Wow. Mm. And you got um, anything coming up? Anything in the pipeline? Yeah, Anybody there's a few for? collabs coming out this week. Look out oh. for that. Um, when this drops, yeah, it'll be out. I may as well just say it, I guess. It's up to you, yeah. Yeah, if you're with a, yes. This yeah. is coming out on Friday for sure. That's right, Friday for sure. <laughs> for sure. <yeah. laughs> Friday for sure. For yeah. sure. Yeah, for Friday. sure. That's dropping, Ooh. yeah. Dope, dope, dope. Um, and a few other things. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and when are you working with us, please? Because we want a Leonie Joyce edit. We do. We, we do. want to, you know. Because I, I, I did say... good at dancing, especially him. No, I'm, I'm not good at dancing. dancing. Don't no. try. He's good at dancing. He's good at dancing. You I'm are good at dancing. I heard you guys did music as well. Yeah. Mm. But yeah, music, but he's the good, he's the dancer <laughs> of the group. <laughs> no, he's the dancer. What say you to that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I was this an one, artist. These this two were no, This one, no, yeah, it wasn't on B2K. Gangy, yeah, yeah, we were guys, so that's yeah. yeah. Get us yeah, one. When you thing. said that, do you know what I thought straight away? You know that? I'm not going to. I'm not you know saying. the guy that, I don't know who the artist is, and he goes. <laughs> Wait, I hope you guys know this. Cause no, go on, say, please, please. It's Afro Beats, and he's like, I'm Saddam Kabaka. I thought your voice was like, I thought your voice was like. Oh, I'm still Jai Holland. Yeah, that was a big track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, we, yeah, was, yeah. we wasn't on that type of vibe. We was Afrobeat. So, what can we do, a Leonie Joyce edit to that? We need to to that song. We'll I don't do it. to that song. Let's no, to it. our own song, one of our old classic songs. We'll oh, one. okay. Mm-hmm. Even we'll more. Yeah? yeah, we'll do one to one of our songs. Yeah. Guys, have you seen them? You have to bring many clothes because they drop from the sky. They drop <laughs> from everywhere. Listen, yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, so before you Sniper. go, one question I want to yeah. ask you though, because I I just been looking at your page and I can't come off of it. I swear to you, one thing I tell you: Do you do the edits yourself? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? She's sick. Mm. She's dope. That is so sick. Not, so today's video, it took me like 12 hours to edit. To edit. Bro, oh, bro the videos are... Mugsy be complaining. Oh, One, two hour edit. <laughs> she wound up. He'll Who be, does he'll two hours? He'll be, he'll be, he'll be complaining. Hours. He'll be complaining. <laughs> Oh, I've been editing snippets, this video. Snippets, huh? snippets. 12 no, hours. I, she wound up for your Editing people <laughs> talking is hard. It is hard because you're hearing, you're like, why did you say, um, why are you going yeah, like Yeah, and then it's boring, isn't it? I did the same with the volumes, bro. I do not do it, but I edit in like uh, talking. Jace, you're not here to back monkey, please. Yeah, please. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Should I tell you who my favourite is? No, I'm joking. <laughs> I, I, know, I, know, I already know you're who your favourite is. Who's divides? my favourite? It's Uzi. Everybody knows. Everybody do you know, knows. I have a favourite for different things. Mm. So like, if I'm just looking, if anybody was to be my friend, it would be you, to be honest. Me? Yeah. Swear. Wow. I like your viewpoints on most things, to be wow. honest. You're the most reasonable person. But I wow. like I different, like, weird, quirky people. That's why. I like. Yeah, that's why I like. Yeah, oh. Weirdo, we know. Weirdo. <laughs> oh, weirdo. That's why we like him. That's why we love Uzi, man.
So wow. me and this, I like. No, I love you. you. There you go. I love you. 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 Listen, she I just made my day. Them. Oh, you yeah, know. exactly. <laughs> love you. you know, she, yeah, there you go. You happy I like now? that. I think we might do a poll. We might do a poll. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we might have to do a poll. Just yeah, like, we'll do a poll. yeah, we'll do a poll. Who's your favorite? You want to cause problems? <laughs> uh, it does, it? Please, let's not do this. I'm poll. joking. Hey, this episode has been so I lit, man. I'm sorry we got to close now. But yeah, that was Leonie Joyce. Number one content creator on Instagram. Shade Room is Number plugged one. her. Bear Blogs are plugged her. I think you're on Shade Borough. So go and follow her. Go and see her videos. She's just released one on Baychella. And probably by the time we drop this uh, JD Sports collab. Yes, this will be out. Need to bring yeah. us in on those collabs, by the way. We also want to make money. <laughs> Listen, guys. In my Leonie, opinion, did podcast. you also sign the NDA? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, follow us on Instagram, in my opinion, podcast UK, Facebook, yeah. same uh IMO Pod UK on Twitter. We are on Spotify, we are on Apple Podcasts, in my opinion, podcast. Obviously on the YouTube, subscribe, mm-hmm. comment, like, mm-hmm. tell us if you know we've said press anything that little out bell, turn. That bell Yeah, thing. T- press Come the bell on. thing. What does the bell do? Um, notifications. notification yeah that's it thank that's you. what thank the bell you. does please press that guy we appreciate bell does your support <laughs> we hope today's been educative we've just been honest with you obviously we definitely are number one supporters of women and women's rights but at the same time just letting you into the mind, the men of my, the minds of men mm. and how we think of this topic oh, I thought you said minds of men <laughs> of mice and men it could have worked it could have worked it but yeah we've been your boys along with Leonie Joyce peace peace